What's going on everybody? It's your boy the low-key legend. How the fuck y'all doing today? I'm doing all right today I am back with a brand new episode of stoner tips for you guys Yes, sir. We are back jumping on board with episode 141 of the stoner tips series guys Today's topic is one. I'm surprised I did not cover before we're gonna be talking about greening out AKA if you guys don't know what greening out is pretty much when you smoke and you pass out from smoking weed So if this hasn't happened to you guys I mean, congratulations, but I'm trying to help some people out out there who may have suffered from this or in the future You guys might suffer from this as well So in the end man if you learn anything from this video in any sort of way be sure to hit that like button It's also been a while since I'm behind the mic guys, and I'm glad like, I'm glad I'm talking to you guys again Finally getting the flow of YouTube getting it back in my blood again, and I'm getting back more active So thank you guys for waiting so patiently for me. Let's dive on into this episode. So greening out uh, or passing out from smoking weed guys so me myself I have done this probably I'm gonna be honest with you guys probably four or five different times you know that coming off is a high number and as I was doing this these all happened what from when I started smoking weed up until maybe two years after okay maybe a year and a half after so I was going through this for a, like every t every I'd pass out once every couple months and it, it was it was not okay and I found out at the end of all my trial and errors how to avoid passing out so if this has happened to you guys don't worry it is very scary because I have been in situations where I was so excited to rip my bong. I had it over my, at my friend's house. We were all having a party. I just snuck out of my house, man. It was going to be crazy. We all go outside in the back patio and I take a rip of the bong. Uh, I had green, so I, I ripped it. I took a fat, a fat rip. And this was my one of my first times smoking. This is the first bong I've ever gotten. And I wanted to milk the hell out of that thing, guys. So that's what I did. I took a fat ass rip. When I inhaled, held it in, passed it. And then all of a sudden, guys, I didn't let go of that smoke. For some reason, it stayed in my body, and then I leaned slowly backwards, lost consciousness, and I landed on my friend's, uh, he has like a little sand pit, and surrounded around the sand pit is wooden two by fours, and I landed, uh, my back landed on one of them. I, no, I think I tripped over one of them when I landed, and I landed inside the sandbox, and my head barely missed the uh, top of the wooden plank. Moral of the story, guys, you could be in a d very dangerous smoking spot and at the wrong time, pass out and that is very scary guys so i'm going to tell you right now if this does happen to you this is the only way i found out to avoid doing this guys now it is kind of a weird habit that i had um and not a lot of people have ever greened out because common sense were to tell you to blow the smoke out um but as a kid i didn't know that so i thought that the longer you hold it in the longer you get high that's really what i believed you know for a year and a half two years no one really you know told me otherwise and i don't know I, that's just what i what i thought because every time I did hold hell hold a hit in it made me so much higher but then again reading more doing more research into weed I realized that it's just me getting lightheaded and kind of just killing brain cells at that point so very stupid of me to do that and think that but as a, as again guys I was 16 you know at the time so I, I, I'm learned a lot from this and maybe some of you guys out there might have not learned this yet but if this has happened to you there's nothing to be scared about guys just remember to always exhale your hit Always exhale it. As soon as you're done with it, make sure you do not forget to blow out, guys. You always have to blow out. It, like, don't try to keep it in there for any longer than you can't handle. I would say just as soon as it hits your lungs, blow it right out, especially if you are passing out. Even if it's not frequently, guys, because this didn't have happen frequently, only on certain occasions where I was either really excited and I wanted to get super high and, you know, I just wanted to have a good time right off the bat, which in that circumstance I did. I, I, I was, you know, pumped. I wasn't high yet. I wanted to get the first milky ass hit. It was my weed. So I just milked the shit out of it, took a fat ass hit and was holding it in, expecting to, you know, get super high afterwards. I ended up passing out and uh, woke up sober as fuck, guys. It really kills your entire uh, soberness once you pass out. And then it can, and it's also embarrassing. In a way, I also, every time I passed out, I pr kind of felt embarrassed. But then again, it is my fault. It's me being dumb and trying to hold the smoke in. Or it can be me forgetting to blow the smoke out. I'm not sure exactly what it was. I'm guessing it was probably me forgetting to blow the smoke out. 
but I could be wrong. So I, anyways, th those are just some of the main tips I can give you guys on passing out and greeting out and how to avoid it. Make sure you're well hydrated as well. These are some more common sense tips I'm going to give you guys. Uh, have a good meal before you smoke. You know, make sure you're hydrated. Make sure you are um, calm. Make sure you calm yourself down. Don't be anxious, you know, just because it's your first time or one of your first times smoking out of a bong. You, you feel confident. You got a high tolerance. You've been um, holding in hits for a long time. Your first time ripping a bong, man, it can, it, it's... I haven't seen anybody, I have seen people pass out actually as well, and I had to explain to her what she was doing wrong, and that is something that I've always wanted to make a video on, and I cannot believe that now is, like, episode 141 is, is the episode where I decide to go ahead and make um, passing out. I'm really surprised I never made that before, guys, but I really uh, do appreciate whoever left that comment because I wouldn't have seen this if I didn't see the comment section of my YouTube videos of stoner tips looking through ideas. I'm not sure who gave this idea out, but whoever it is, man, huge shout out to you, bro. I appreciate that a lot. If you guys have any other suggestions for stoner tips, be sure to leave them in the comment section right now, man. I'd really appreciate that. I'll go through them. Make sure you guys check my channel, or if you do see one and you want an updated version of it, drop that in the comment section, but make sure you look at my channel before you comment anything that has to do with a... Um, something I already did. If, if it's something I already did, make sure you say that you want me to redo it. I didn't explain it correctly. Give me a reason why I should redo it. Because I do feel like on a lot of my YouTube Stoner Tip series videos in the, like, I say like episodes, maybe, I don't know. A lot of my older ones, I feel like a couple of them I could easily pick out and redo. But I want to know if you guys want me to. So leave them in the comment section if you have any any recommendations, man. Anyways, guys, it's your boy, the low-key legend, man. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope this video did help some people out out there from greening out or passing out because that can very, very be dangerous in a lot of different ways depending on where you're smoking at you could be driving and take a dab and pass out you know that is the last thing anyone ever ever needs so make sure guys you always exhale instantly just especially if you have a habit of passing out like i did exhale instantly even for the first three months you know just don't hold it in your lungs at all just get it in there just get it in your lungs and then blow out instantly. Just remember to blow out. That's the biggest tip I can give you guys. And then remember to breathe as well. You need to keep breathing. Just take normal deep breaths, you know, and and you will not pass out. It's it's more of a mental thing than anything. You have to make sure you are... I explained it, but I just really want to kind of keep going over it because I feel like it's such a danger to certain people who can green out in bad situations. And this is the way to fix it. So I really hope I can help some of you guys out out there, man. If I did, drop them in the comment section if I missed any tips and you guys have any other suggestions for people because this is really going to be big, I think. I think this is something that's going to help a lot of people out from greening out. But even though there might not be a lot of people who green out, I'm one of them people who did. And I know people who have. And that small enough circle is very dangerous when it comes to smoking weed and passing out in certain situations. Like when I passed out in the sandbox, I could have really split my head wide open from a nail. Like there was, I, I, it was ridiculous guys. It was just, please be safe. Please share this video. If you have anyone who knows, uh, or just share this information at least to anyone, you know, who passes out or has a problem with it. And if it did help drop a like, Subscribe to the YouTube channel if you guys are new. My name is The Low Key Legend. I upload all sorts of stoner tips videos. This is episode 141. I got 140 other ones you guys should go check out if you need help in the stoner tips category. Anyways, man, you already know what's good. I'm going to catch you guys very shortly in a brand new video. Y'all stay safe. Stay savage. Stay low key. It's your boy, The Low Key Legend. I'm out of here, guys. Adios.